Join us now for Get Fit on ATMC TV, your community channel. Hi, and welcome to Cardio Kickboxing. My name is Terry Hansen. I am a group fitness instructor here at the BCC Fitness and Aquatic Center. And joining me today, I have Ashley and Jeannie, both instructors here as well at the BCC Fitness and Aquatic Center. So glad that you could join us. So let's get started. Now your shoulders are down, your arms are pumping, okay? And your knees are high. Four more, right here. So it's four, and three, and two. Let's take it wider. Four. Remember, shoulders down, abs nice and tucked. We're gonna take it to that bob and weave. Let's go. Now again, a bob and a weave is essentially a squat, okay? As you're weaving away from your opponent, your guards are up, nice and strong. Four, three, Two, let's jab. And you can always sight where you're punching. Just remember, shoulders down, abs nice and tucked, supporting that lower spine. And hook. You can always give yourself a little target to hit. It's an arc. Good. Four, three. And on top of that, have a little fun, right? Two more, and uppercut. Now this is a big body punch. So you're lifting up your opponent, right? Nice and strong. Four more, four, three, two. Let's jab. And again, side where you're punching. Let's hook, uppercut. Two more times, let's jab and hook, uppercut and jab. Hook, uppercut, just bob and weave for me, right here, right here, good, good. We're gonna take it to the knees, to the front, here we go, knee. And again, when you're doing any kind of kicks, this is where they start. Your knee bends, first of all, okay, it's called chambering, good. You're offset on the body, so you're not gonna lean forward. You wanna stay offset, using the hip flexors and the abs. Bring it up, bring it up that knee. Good, let's do four more. Four, three, two. Let's kick it. Again, remember the chamber. It's a snap kick, right? You can point the toe or you can flex the foot. Either way. It's okay. Four more. Four. Three. Two. Side to side kick. Good. Now with a side kick, your base leg is going to point to either 10 o'clock or two o'clock, okay? Very important. You do not want your feet forward, okay? It could mess up your knee, and we don't want that. Back kicks. Again, chambering, bending the knee, pushing out. Four, three, two. Knees to the front. Good, good. Four, three, two. Bob and weave. Perfect. All right. We're going to bring this around. Guards are up, okay, it's your right fighting stance. Leg is in front, leg is in back. Guards are up, we're gonna jab cross. 
Ready? Here we go. Use your breath. Good. How we doing, ladies? We have fun in cardio kickboxing now. Four. Shoulders down. Abs tucked. Let's add the hook. Jab, cross, hook. Jab, cross, hook. Jab, cross, hook. You say it to yourself, you'll get it. Yeah. Right? Come on, come on. Add the uppercut. Jab, cross, hook, upper. Good, good. Here's four. Three. Now we're gonna add a kick, okay? So, you're gonna step with your back foot and you're gonna kick with the front leg, okay? Let's put it all together. Jab, cross, hook, upper, step, boom. Kick, good. Yee-hoo! How we doing, y'all? Come on, come on, four more. Nice and strong. Stay with it. Woo, one more. Bob and weave. All right. Left foot's in front, okay? Left foot's in front. Jab cross. Ready? Here we go. Use your breath. Right, Jeannie? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We have fun here at the BCC Fitness and Aquatic Center. You should come join us, right? Come on down. <laughs> come on down. Add the hook. Strong, strong. Add the uppercut. Whoosh. Good, good. Four more. Three more. All right. We're gonna add that kick again, here we go. Jab, kick, jab, cross, hook, upper, step, kick. If you say it to yourself, it's a little easier to get. And so much fun! Woo! Good, good. Come on. One more. Bob and we. Add the jab, hook, uppercut, jab. Good, hook it. Woo! Are we strong back there? Oh yeah. We got one more just like this. Hook, uppercut. Now you're just gonna bob and weave right here, okay? In four, three, two, Guards up and knees. Right here. All right. We ready? Let's kick it. Four, three. Cross punch. Jack. And squat. Whoosh. Kick it. Good. Cross. And jack. And squat. Kick it. Cross. Jack. Squat. Two more. Kick it. Good. Cross. Jack. Good. Squat. Oh. We got one more, kick it. Good. Cross. Jack. And squat. Stay here. Woo woo! How we feeling? Sweating. That's all the fun that we have here. Two more. Now slow it. Use your breath, right? 
Oh yeah. Down and lift. Down. Now, we're gonna add a kick. Ready? Here we go. Down. Use your breath. Four more. Bob and weave. Right here. Good jab. And hook. Shoulders down. Uppercut. And jab. Hook. Uppercut. Just bob and weave, right here. Now, cross knee in four, three, two, here we go. Yee-hoo! Three, two, four more, four, three. Three knees, side kick. Knee, 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 side set. Knee, knee. Knee, side, set. Knee, 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 side, set. Knee. Knees only. Yeah, yeah. Bob and weave. Foot turns out to the side. Cross knee. Here we go. Side set. One, two, three. Side set. Knee, knee. Lots of control. Two more. One more. Knees only. Four, three. Bob and weave. Right here. Bring it up. And marching it out, guards up. Four, three, two, side step, two of them. Good. Low block. Mid block. We'll add two more. And march it here. Beautiful, let's take that breath in. Blow it out. One more time. And bring it down. Thank you so much for joining us today. Please come check us out at the BCC Fitness and Aquatic Center. We have many, many classes that we offer on our schedule. And Jeannie, Ashley, and myself would welcome you here. So please check us out online at www.bccfitness.com. Or you can also check us out on Instagram. We're there as well. Thanks again for joining. We look forward to seeing you soon. Each week, a different church uh, that belongs to the council has a responsibility of getting the food, packing the food and distributing the food. Uh, I happen to be standing in one of our units over here at Prime Storage, uh, where we do store uh, food that we buy from distributors and from the food bank in Wilmington. The food pantry is um, available to anyone in Brunswick County every Saturday. They are welcome to come every Saturday. We serve you from 10 until 12 at Camp United Methodist Church on Main Street in Shalotte. And, um, all you need to do is show us some, some sort of paperwork that shows that you live in Brunswick County. Uh, folks that live down here, it's easier to withstand summer heat and not turn on your air conditioning or fans uh, than it is to withstand the cold in the winter. So if you're paying for heat, then you don't have as much money to pay for food or anything else. And so we see a lot more people coming for help in the winter. A local company like ATMC is what I consider, it's Brunswick County is what it is. Okay, uh, when we have these membership corporations here, 
<clears throat> it just represents the whole county. And when the county is like friends feeding friends and neighbors helping neighbors, and that's literally what it is. I mean, figuratively and literally. And it just means a lot. And I, I more than appreciate it when there are funds available uh, through good management from ATNC uh, with regard of how they handle their business and uh, are able to provide uh, funding for us to give back to the community as well. Welcome. This is going to be Gentle Pilates Yoga. My name is Jeannie Singley. I'm one of the instructors here at the BCC Fitness and Aquatic Center. Today I'm joined by Ashley and Terry, both of our land group exercise instructors. So the best part about today's class is you don't need any equipment. You can use a mat, you can use the carpet, and anybody can do it. Most of the time we'll be on the mat. If you don't feel comfortable coming up when we come up, that's okay. You can stay right where you are. So we're gonna start with a, a little yoga warm up, go into some lengthen, strengthen, and toning moves, and then we'll end with a couple of deeper stretches. All right, are we ready to get started? All right, let's start on all fours. So in our tabletop position, you wanna set your shoulders directly over your wrists, spreading your fingers, and then your hips directly over your knees. We're gonna come right into our cat cow. So focusing on our breath, I want it to take an inhale as you sink the chest down and lift the chin. Keeping the mouth closed on your exhale, we're gonna peel up, rounding the back and tucking the chin. And again, inhale, sink down, lift up. Exhale, round and tuck. One more time. This is a great thing to do to start moving that spine if it's feeling stiff at any time throughout the day. All right, a little more movement. We're gonna shift the hips back towards your heels and then start to walk your hands forward a little bit and slowly shift the hips forward to the mat. The head is the last thing, but it lifts as well. Oh, it feels so good. Articulating through that spine moving through flexion and extension. Shifting back and forward. We're gonna take that into some hip circles here. So you're gonna take the hips, take them over to the right, circle back towards the heels, over to the left and drop them forward. Great way to open up the hips and lower back. We're gonna take it around one more time. And then I'm gonna have you stop and take it in the other direction, starting over to the left. And back and around. One more. Come on up. Coming back to your tabletop position, we're gonna go in to thread the needle just to open up the shoulders. So I want you to take your right hand out in front, up on the fingertips. On the inhale, twist that left arm open. On the exhale, thread the left hand under the right arm, staying up on the fingertips, keeping the elbow lifted. Back to that yoga breath, three deep breaths in and out through the nose. Hearing your breath in the back of your throat like the sound of the ocean. And then we'll start to take it back up and set it up on the other side. So the left comes in front, up on the fingertips. We're gonna inhale as the right arm twists open. Exhale, thread the right under the left. Again, keep the elbow lifted up on your fingertips. Three deep breaths in and out through the nose. And come on up. All right, we are gonna stay on uh, our knees, but we're gonna drop down 
to the elbows. Now, as we get started here in our Pilates um, phase, we want to make sure that the elbow stays in alignment with the wrist. So we're not going to clasp here. So we want to keep the shoulders engaged. So if you can see me here, I've got my wrist and my elbow lined up. I'm not here. All right, so try to maintain that alignment. From here, we're going to start with the left leg. So go ahead and extend it out. Make sure that that left hip doesn't try to turn open. Both hips stay square towards the mat. We're going to point the toes, lift, and lower. Lift and lower. Shoulders down away from the ears. Your gaze is towards the tip of the nose. Down and up. Start to feel that glute engage. You'll also feel the lower back. This is a great core exercise for five, four, three, two, one. Hold it here. Flex the foot. So now I'm pushing the heel out, and we're going to curl and extend. Nice and slow. Curl and extend. Curl. So as you're curling, think about that hamstring contracting. Curl. Yes. And extend. Think lengthening. That's what Pilates is all about. Long, lean muscles. Four. Three. Two. One more here. Curl and extend. Take it back to your curl. We're going to lift, lift, lift. Press that heel up towards the ceiling. Little pulses, little pulses. Squeeze it, squeeze it for 10 and 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, last 3, 2, and 1. Nice job. Did we feel that? All right. Open those knees, big toes together. Ah, child's pose. Stretch it out. Forehead to the mat. Nice deep breath here. And then we're going to set ourselves up on the other side. So let's come on down to those elbows again. Wrist line up with the elbows. We're going to extend that right leg this time. Toes are pointed, shoulders back, lift and lower. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. So you remember, think about those hips. Those hips are trying to stay square. That's gonna force the glute to take that work over. Also contracting through the lower back. We need a strong lower back to prevent injury, right? Five, four, three, Hold it up on one for me. Flex that foot. Give me a curl. Curl, nice and slow. Extend. Curl. Extend. Curl. The more we focus on the muscles we're working, the more you're going to feel it. Out and in. Five. Four, taking those little corrections. Remember, the hips stay square towards the mat as much as you want to lean that weight into the left side. I think we have one more. Might be two, but we'll keep it here. Go ahead and bend it. And heel presses up, up, up. Here we go. Hips are square. Press it up. Keep that glute contracted here. Finish it out. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, and five, four, Three, last two, and one. Nice job. Open those knees, big toes together. This time, let's take the hands back. And come back into your child's pose. All right, come on up. We're going to get to that, those abdominals now. So let's come over onto our backs. All right, so to get started, I want you to think about that pelvic area here. We're gonna take a couple pelvic tilts. So as I tilt up, 
I could reach my hands back and have plenty of space. Now I want you to tilt that pelvis to take that space out, okay? So let's take the palms down. Give me some basic pelvic tilts here. Feel those lower abs engage. Up and press it out. Here we go, a little faster. This time our Pilates breath, we're in through the nose, we're out through the mouth. For eight, you should already feel those abs engaging. Six, five, four, three, and two, one. Okay guys, clamshell with the legs. That means I'm gonna bring the soles of the feet together. I'm gonna open those knees like a diamond. I'm gonna take the hands back behind the head, fingertips back behind the head. So as soon as we do this, that pelvic tilt, you can really feel that arch in the back. So what I want you to focus on as you lift is pressing that belly button back towards the spine. Nice space between the chin and the chest, tiny lift and lower. Exhale up, remember that breath. In through the nose, out through the mouth. You should feel that little shaky shaky at the top. If you ever come to my classes, that's my favorite part. You will hear me say it. Shaky shaky means we're working hard. <laughs> All right guys, keep it down. Now the fun part, keep the feet together. We're gonna lift and lower those legs. Up and down, exhale up. This is where we focus on that lower back, right? Trying not to over-exaggerate that arch. Use that exhale to press it back down. Two. Okay, now we put it together. You ready? And lower. Up and down. Use that exhale, lift. Inhale, lower. Six. We're so close. Five. Four. Three, last two, and one. Ah, oh, relax it. Open those arms to a T. Open the feet nice and wide. Let's drop those knees left. Take a nice deep breath. And other side. Extend that right leg. We're gonna do a piriformis stretch here. So we're gonna take that left hand outside the knee. We're gonna take the right hand outside the ankle. Start to shift that knee towards the center of the body. And then that ankle comes back down towards the hip. And you should be feeling the stretch right down the center of that glute. Nice deep breath, guys. One more, one more. Now take that right hand outside that left knee, big spinal twist. Let's make the other side match, all right? Come on back. Right knee in, right hand outside, left to the ankle. Move that knee to the center, then pull the ankle down. Three deep breaths in and out through the nose. If you can't get that ankle down, you can always bend the knee. It's just gonna depend on how open those hips and glutes are. And we'll take it to that full spinal twist. Left hand outside that right knee, twisting over, look out over that right hand. And release it. Take your hands behind the knee, rock yourself up to see. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you guys are able to do this and come and visit us here. Our, our senior dental Pilates yoga class is Tuesdays at 10.15, and we look forward to seeing you soon. Check out our full schedule of classes at bcpfitness.com or check us out on Facebook or Instagram.